va a tener las calzones del Atlético de Madrid. Partan a Fox Minus porque yo comencé y salve a toda la gente de la animación que también. I'm glad to see that uh, Barcelona have their their full uh, full team out tonight, which is great. Really looking for Boateng, Alinea, and Umtiti. Leo Messi with a serious look on his face goes across to greet his rival captain tonight, Diego Godin, playing what will surely be his last game here in the Camp Nou as Atletico Madrid captain. Of course, back in 2013 on the bench for Simeone's men, Adan, Kalinic, Correa, Savic, Juanfran, Morata, Vitolo. Leo Messi, the best player of March, receiving the trophy from another Barca legend, Pat Patrick Kluivert. He just doesn't stop earning the uh, silver. Let's go in the famous uh, red and white stripes. Barca in the famous response of the Camp Nou to Antoine Griezmann, who goes in to challenge Messi. Messi just brushes into Sergio. Uh, Sergio Roberto breaks forward, lays it off to Messi. Little one two with Suarez. Time to look up. Suarez quickly out to Messi. Kutic. Rakitic to Messi, Busquets again. Flicked over the top for Swanev to chase the advantage for Diego Tic. Oh, he does superbly well to find Artur, and it's a good inter at the top form we've seen him all season. Rakitic finding Messi. Still Messi. Picks out Alba, lovely ball over the top. He's got pace, which is similar to Alba. I think that really counts offensively and defensively. Thomas Partey, the return ball from Saul wasn't the best one. Messi, Messi gets away from Thomas. Messi goes down, back on his feet again. Well, the idea was superb as you look for Coutinho. Simon and I think Coutinho did well to keep it away from Rodri. Messi nearly lost his footing once, lost it the second time. And Messi on the ground has better footwork than uh, many other top flight players. But Barca playing a little bit at the limit there. Busquets pass wasn't quite right. Artur got there, let it get away from him. Messi got there and it bounced away from him too. Steve's point about him to switch play from flank to flank quicker by the looks of things. Here's Messi. Messi turns, gets away from Thomas Partey. Lovely ball into oh. Jordi Alba! Oh, and Alba cannot believe that. He did so well, there's a smile on his face. He got the ball beyond or black. Yeah, but I think they go to right here, Graham, because he missed. Felipe Luis uh, with a poor yeah, ball there. Really and, shot. and that's that's the beauty of Jordi Alba, the pace he's got. Mexican. Decision. I'm not sure Luis Suarez does either as we watch Alba again. It's a lovely first touch, just flicks it beyond the reach of Oblak who quite frankly made himself just about as big as a goalkeeper can be by Costa, but he just couldn't quite hold on to it for long enough, and Leo Messi, superb footwork, Rakitic first time for Suárez to chase. Be comfortable, Atletico, Costa holding it up, gives it right to Messi though, you don't want to do that too often. The call was shoot first time, he was perfectly set up. His Messi turns in the seventh centre circle, finds Suárez who tries to return it to Messi, gets the rebound and acrobatically gets the shot off but has no control and puts it over the bar. I mean, he showed the way there, a sniff of a chance and all right, neither Arias nor Thomas who I was going to blame as well. They yep. each had big opportunities in the box, Steve, right or wrong? Inside the box, not far off uh, the six shot. To Rakitic. Messi returning it to Rakitic. And now Busquets finds Messi. Thomas Partey with a firm challenge. Rakitic picks up the loose ball, finds Sergio Roberto. Messi again. Now Rakitic. Busquets. Sergio Roberto. Messi. Down he goes under a joint challenge from Thomas and Griezmann. Play on, says the referee. Busquets finds Messi. This time he goes down again. The whistle goes, and it's uh, a free kick. And this is exactly what we were talking about ahead of the game, Graham. You do not foul Leo Messi within that distance of your own penalty. Yeah, it's on, we've seen the last three matches where he's come up with... He's conjured up, not come up with. 
brilliant ideas how to beat the wall, how to beat the goalkeeper. And what Rodri must know is, no matter how desperate he felt that situation was, he took the, the wrong remedy. Well, a, a couple of seasons ago, last season rather, Diego Simeone, as we've seen, said the difference between these two teams was the Barcelona number 10. This could be the moment of the Barcelona number 10, Lionel Messi against Jana Black. Messi! What? Half a metre above the bar? Yeah, no, no, pace or direction on it. Uh, keeper was um, live to it, knew what was happening. He had a good view of it because he came way this side of the goal so he could see Messi, and he's quick in his feet to get across to, to cover it. You know, we, uh, we raised, there was maybe the world heard the collective raising of eyebrows as Busquets misplaced a pass five, six minutes ago. What I think it's all from Suarez, Suarez squared to Messi, tries the return ball, got it. Everybody else continues with 25 minutes gone to be playing at helter-skelter pace, and although Artur hasn't opened Atleti up, he is imposing patience and... Did you collect it? Just no time to even analyse can you say the main thing is that Barcelona created the chance Simon Coutinho was there and he it doesn't so have much of a choice Partey can play right back Savage had been out previous a player to say something players swear at the referee all the time they yep. just do it's just part of the game but it must have been something over and above that which is really incredible to think they can incur a red card I just can't understand it Simeone has his hand on his chin, he's got some big thinking to do, his game plan falling apart now with 29 minutes played. Well, I'm sure you'll agree with us, Lee, that is... Uh, is that Ortega with one of the Cholo Simeone and... Uh, Musquets gets the return ball, tries the first-timer to Messi, it's taken off him. Convinced that what he didn't like was the referee allowing play on, it, he used one abusive term, another one, the referee said enough, red card. That's that's the way I feel things happened. Lee, Rodri is, is, is looking fine now there now. Slovakian keeper is going, he, one raise of those eyes and he puts it to the other side. Messi, good ball to Al. That little inside pass, a back heel pass from Suarez would have got the ball free quicker, but... Artur for Barcelona, back to Messi. Messi running at Partey, Partey with the interception. And it's Sergio Roberto who collects on the halfway line. Artur again. Atletico just got to get to halfway, I think, Simon, without conceding. And they'll be happy and get reorganised. Messi, Piquet. Leo Messi to Artur, who's quick to find. He leaves it for Messi. Rakitic, Busquets, Messi inside to Rakitic, now Busquets, now it's Messi, straight at Jana Black, who clutches that one gratefully. But the, the reason that pattern that Steve was commenting on was broken was that they did so much work out wide to take Saul away from the space in front of Messi, where he's been patrolling and shutting off the movement, shutting off the little corridors, and when they did that, the ball was shut. Absolutely struck that firmly. Here he is again, a slightly gentler pass. Messi. Wide to Sergio Roberto, cuts it back to Messi. Uh, not even Messi can get through there. Gets away from Rodri. Finds Leo Messi. It's three against four. Messi wide, Suarez. Puts the return ball in, Coutinho, Jano Black. Not bad, nice break by Barcelona, good pace, did everything up. Since, I seem to recall, the 28th minute, um, and that took a little bit of the oomph out of this game, which, until the moment of Costa sending off, was an absolutely spectacular, frenetic clash between...
The players about to come out onto the pitch for the second half. The Atletico team uh, coming out first to the jeers of the home fans. They must really feel like Christians. I mean, I say again because it was an extraordinary Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. Square to Messi. Sergio Roberto back to Rakitic. Busquets is Jordi Alba. Now Messi over the top towards Alba Partey clears from Ivan Rakitic. I think there's no, no doubt, Simon, at half the box. The ball into Messi in, in the edge of the D. Messi's not moving too much, just standing around there waiting for it. They just cannot get that ball into him in that area. Good run from Coutinho, cuts it back to Messi. Busquets! Gets away from Thomas, finds Messi. Uh, played over the top. Courtney reacting, Steve was. Steve was waving his arm in the air in fury, as an ex striker would do. Yeah. Jordi Alba. Suarez. The shot gets. Messi. Messi. Dispossessed. Messi. Lovely first touch. Messi. Messi shot. Well held by Jana Black. But the Camp now appreciate the little genius of skill there. The only time all night that Jimenez hasn't anticipated what Messi was going to do. Gets there first, dances around Koki, and the shot gets off. Jimenez isn't out, can't do anything about it. Oblak saves it, but Messi comes awake. Loose ball collected by Rod. Yeah, it's an attacking change, it has to be said. Felipe Luis, the left back coming off. Alvaro Morata on, a striker again wow. to join Griezmann that's up front. He's going for a Simeone. That's, that's a big call. Uh -oh. And he plays it square, and the only man there is Thomas Partey. Ready to make the first change, it'll be Malcolm who's getting stripped and ready to come on. Messi. Still Messi. Rodri got a foot in, but Messi still goes through. It took a deflection on the way through, and now Oblak grasps it. And I think there lies the, the, the missing link. Messi's not in the game tonight. The Barca's not the same, of course, when he's not in the game, but it's really more distinctive tonight. For very Sal hits it straight. Uh, Rakitic is Messi. Messi crosses the halfway line. He's got Suarez with him. Messi gets away from Godin. Lays it off for Suarez. Jan or Black. What a goalkeeper. Suarez shakes his head as well he might. Jan or Black saving Atletico once again. You know, sometimes having watched them so often, you get a feeling. Whether it's Suarez or Messi or back in the day, Edzo or Villa, when this movement of Barcelona carves open the opposition, you get a feeling, yeah, that'll be slotted. I never believed, as brilliant as Suarez is, that this was going in. All Black's movement and the way he gets. Messi. Griezmann with a sliding challenge. Messi avoids it. Messi with a shot. Or Black again. Needed two attempts to grasp it this time. Messi starting to knock on the door, Steve Archibald. Yeah, he, uh, the game is spacing out a little bit. I think that Atletico a little bit tired. This is Messi time, I think. We've seen it the last couple of instances, getting closer and closer. I, I think the Cam Noah agrees with you, Steve. You can hear the chance of Messi make the birdies done. Clearly, my idea was bringing Malcolm on. He's left-footed, he should be playing on the left. It was continuous. But find Sergio Roberto again. Inside to Messi. Rodri's with him, still Messi turns away from Rodri, finds Rakitic. Just about controlled by Alba, Rakitic again, Messi once more. Coutinho, dispossessed, Rakitic wins the loose ball. Here's Jordi Alba, inside for Messi. Messi wins the corner, well defended indeed by Jimenez, who's been superb. Alba, Messi. Rakitic, Sergio Roberto again, Messi, first time in to Busquets, that's better, Malcolm. Forced back onto the left foot, finds Sergio Roberto, there's Leo Messi. In midweek, he should be on this, if he wants Malcolm switching play, Malcolm should be on the left and Coutinho should be off. Messi combining with Coutinho, Suarez holding it up, Messi shot on black again, and another save from Malcolm. Jana Black clasps that ball, 
and once again turns into Atletico's hero momentarily at least. Well, Black it's really has made the difference tonight. He's had two or three magnificent saves. Yep. Also had a little bit of luck on, on... Ten men. As soon as Messi had the ball in space, two men on him. That real... Messi standing absolutely still. Malcolm finds him. Now Messi moves up a gear. Still Messi, and it's a great challenge from Correa. Malcolm. Alba. Messi. Jimmy gets it back from Malcolm. Now Leo Messi. First time. It's Coutinho. Square to Messi. Messi dispossessed by Griezmann. He's uh, saying, that was mine, that was mine. And there's some defending to do now. It was Rodri who got in the way, I believe. And I think that's what Jimenez is saying. <laughs> Lovely play from Malcolm and Messi. Jana Black. That's a little example. I mean, I know I'm going on about Malcolm a lot, but what we've saw towards his other substitutes warming up, I wonder if he's considering risking it and making his final change now. Messi wins it, but it's uh, cleared. Messi stands over it. No wall prepared. He plays it out square to uh, diagonally to Coutinho, gets the ball back, flicks it over the top. It's easily defended. Thomas. Leo Messi goes across for the short one. Sergio Roberto. Alinear knocking it down to Rackett. is put over the top. Messi can't control. Makes a little run now and gets the return ball from Sergio Roberto. Lovely footwork for Messi. Messi's shot took a deflection on his way through. Comfortable for Jano Black. Selves for one last effort. Or will Barcelona put them to the sword? The flag stays down. It's Leo Messi. And what a challenge. It comes back to Messi. Oh, you cheeky little man. 2-0 to Barca. Leo Messi does it. Finally, Atletico have their spirits, their backs, and their hearts broken. It's absolutely astounding for Messi. He, the breakaway is on. It's fancy. Goes in at pace into the box. Thinks he loses it for a minute. Gets back on it. Knows where everybody is round about him. Knows he's got a fraction of time. And just tucks it away to the keeper's left hand post. Absolutely. Excellent. And goal 33 comes at a time when Atleti, even 1-0 down, when that goal from Suarez aren't beaten. I'm certain it's um, Godin who gets the sliding tackle. They block him. They think we've kept him out. But his low centre of gravity, his wit, how he twists. I'm going to see it again. The run is perfectly timed. I think the ball is off Rakitic's foot. Now, when Messi waits and looks and takes a decision, Here's the tackle, it is indeed. Captain Fantastic trying to stop it. Ah, oh, and he can't. Jimenez gets the block. Godin's in the way. I thought Godin was just gonna get in here in a last moment of glory at the camp now. Instead, it's underneath him, and the keeper has no view of it. Unbelievable. Well, watch up here, he's taking everybody across the box. He's leaving that, that cup back into the keeper's left hand post by taking everybody across the goal. He knows exactly what he's doing. See it here from this angle. Take him across. Knows his space is here. Cut back. See in the back of the net. Absolutely Messi-esque. Uh, uh, Lee, uh, final change made by Simeone. The noise here in the camp now is astonishing. Uh, could you just confirm who, was, who came yeah, on? Yeah, it's, it's the right back, Juan Fran, the veteran. Again, I think they've been absolutely outstanding. I think Simeone will be proud of it in the match. I think he'll come out and state that. I think they'll be proud of themselves. And I think they'll be really tired at the end of this game. Yeah, well, they've certainly given absolutely everything they have to give. We're into the final 10 seconds of regulation time. Barca knocking the ball around. Leo Messi, Alinea. And Barcelona can play, have a mediocre game, or not be right on the day. Is something not right? We've discussed it all through this match. But then they've got those. Returns it to Malcolm. Messi. Oh, and he's been absolutely uh, clattered in and just has words. And uh, I don't know what's worse, really. Swearing at the ref or responding. Warriors, in the best sense of that word. Spirit, strategy, technique.
so much guts, but also a team that's been defeated. Let's start with not the champions, the old Atleti when Simeone first took charge. This was the spirit they showed in winning the title. Wasn't to be tonight, but they merited at least a point. Because Barcelona had a kind of offish night in, in many respects. You couldn't get the ball into Messi the way they normally do. Atletico were absolutely brilliant. Nobody can defend against this Barcelona team, I don't think, better than it was defended tonight. And Barcelona still win the match. So, I uh, 60 minutes or more, they can leave. As well, you might have, because Atletico have just won. Uh, Barcelona have just beaten Atletico two goals to nil. Luis Suarez scoring the first of them. And Leo Messi with the second, Graham Hunter. Extraordinary finish. Not, for, from anybody, this would be absolutely, as Steve des described, brilliant from that distance to bend it round and okay, slightly underneath all black. But this isn't Suarez's absolutely, you know, 100% party trick in and around the box. We know he's technically brilliant. We know he's a predator. He's an old style number nine. He doesn't score many like that. And that's why I salute him right now. That appetite for the big moment is what marks out good players, great players and world class footballers. Uh, Steve Archibald, you were absolutely uh, delighted to see that finish. That was sheer class from Swadith. What about this from Messi, though? Yeah, you can see him with Simon in the goal. He's taking the players across into the centre of the box, knowing he's going. the keeper's got to follow him as well, knowing that he's leaving the space for the cutback. You see it here perfectly. Going along, along, bang. And it's absolutely Messi-esque. Nobody else can do that. Kudos to Rakitic, too. Let's, I mean, let's say that release ball, not only perfectly timed, as soon as he saw a hint of space he snooker cued the ball right into the area where the world's greatest footballer